Hi guys, I'm Exact Chaos and welcome back to another episode of Workers and Resources Soviet Republic. It is now officially uh, the 1st of January <laughs> 2021, uh, not the 12th of October 1983. Um, and uh, yeah, we're still playing this series and it's absolutely awesome. Uh, we are building a fair bit of uh, new facilities for people to be living in. Um, so we will continue along that journey. I still need to actually commission these little sections over here. I'm wondering whether I can commission little sections at a time. Uh, probably can't. Let me quickly um, commission all of these and then what I might do is I might just say oh we'll have to assign them one by one. Okay cool. So what I'll do is I'll assign uh, one of these sections so that we can actually bring in some guys to come and build from over here. We also need to do the distribution and all those kind of good stuffs. Okay, let me grab one of these guys and we'll just say, go ahead and build for us that little section right over there. I'm hoping that will work. Okay, what I want to do in this episode, uh, while all of the uh, massive construction projects are still underway, and I can speed it up a little bit, um, I'm thinking we need to redo distribution. Distribution is something that I'm not thrilled about. We've got little bits and pieces of various distribution strategies kind of running on over here. One of them is we originally started importing a lot of stuff um, into this from the border and now we're backfilling some of that from other areas to here then we're distributing from here but we're also directly distributing and all these kind of things aren't working. The other one um, so I'm thinking a new piece like that would be awesome. Uh, we are now producing a fair bit of uh, food. But it seems like we're not really providing a lot of alcohol unless one of these guys are is loading up on alcohol. Yeah, one of these guys is physically loading up on alcohol. Okay, so what I'm going to do first, I've, I've actually gone and got a new mod, um, the modern um, a store mod or something like that is what it's called modern 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 warehouse or modern storage or something like that so what I'm thinking in an area like this this is a huge thing it takes a lot of stuff we can really put a lot of stuff in here so I was thinking we try and do a little something maybe over here somewhere yeah, from a road perspective, we're probably going to need to bring the roads up from there. That's not going to be a good spot to get it in. We won't fit it, and I, I want to get a little bit extra room in there. Uh, the idea is, and this comes from some of the comments as well, uh, is that if all of our extra stuff goes into this storage, and then we use this area to start working on on exports. That's that's basically what I what I thought we'll do. So let me try and squeeze it in over here. So if we flatten this terrain, I always thought we might do an extra little town over here, but I don't think that is necessarily what I want to do. So I'd rather just do this and let's see what we can make happen with a nice big storage facility over here. This, this effectively needs to be the, the point from where we distribute. Um, and the plan would also be, um, let's do, okay, I want, okay, let's, uh, let's do that. So we'll place it there. It's not fully done just yet. And so I want to get the, um, the rail connection straight in here so they can load directly. But I was also wondering, it might be worth our while to do, um, from storage perspective, you can do container loading facility. We could do like a container loading facility, uh, which doesn't actually have um, a rail connection. So we'll need to do a rail loading station also if we wanted to do, do something like this. What I was thinking is we could do a joint um, export thing, but I'm worried we're going to start loading everything into containers if we do it this way. I'm not too comfortable and familiar with what the container um, loader is actually does. So the, what I'm doing here, I want to basically uh, get a little bit of a thing going on through here. So if we do something like that, okay, that should be workable. Yeah, that should be quite workable. 
and we can actually we can also provide um, hmm you know what what we'll do is we'll bring it in a little bit more like this okay so we'll do that one and then I'm thinking the other one goes on here hmm from the other direction we join into here and we make a big one-way kind of system in here because we we need to uh, remember so if we do that all right um and then we come out on this side um alternatively if we do it that side first we'll have okay cancel cancel let's let's try something else so instead of doing that, let's try a little path through here. Uh, a, a, a good trick for you guys. Oh, you know what? I forgot about the line spacing. Let's just put the line spacing on. It does make a big, a big, a big difference if we have got the line spacing on versus not on. Got it on. Okay, now back to this rail piece that I'm thinking of here. Um, so I'm tempted to do a little something like this maybe uh, ooh, and another trick is if you put on the wireframe you can find a line to go nice and straight with so we'll do something like this the other thing that I wanted to do was um, go in like that so this will provide some some queuing space for these guys to to do their thing. Uh, let's just zoom it in so I can see where we're at with this and we'll keep it nice and straight. Actually, let's do that one first because that one's on on that one and then if we... That's an interesting maneuver. We do that. Oh, really? You're not going to be able to do that? Mm. Let's uh, trim it back a little. We'll try and extend it um, out like maybe three more slots like so and then we'll do that nice this is going to be awesome there we go the other one will go around there and we'll do that and so this will basically be a lot of train storage to go in here and then what we'll do is we'll uh, get this guy to come out this way we'll get this guy to to feed in there And then we'll do a bit of this and presumably also a bit of that. So that's, it's not, not the tidiest, cleanest thing in the world. Hmm. To have it, to have it do that. But I'm hoping that it won't bother too much. So we'll have the whole thing become become a, a piece here so what we'll need to do is we'll need to provide a switch over here somewhere for these guys to be able to construct here hmm. yeah so we'll have to do these first and they'll be able to go around construct the other sides uh, yeah it'll be it'll be a challenge it will be a challenge okay but anyway that's that's kind of the idea that I've got going here uh, that's a little wonky, but that's okay. There should be a fair bit of room so we'll be able to store a number of vehicles in there. Now let's find ourselves a little bit of a connection through here. If we do that, we can start um, constructing that. Okay, the other bit we potentially need is a little bit of a road cargo station somewhere. So we're a little tight at the moment. Can we squeeze it in? Just doesn't want to, does not want to fit in here. We may have to move those power lines a little bit, but I think we can actually load unload directly in there. So anyway, that, that'll be the starting point of our big hub and we'll use this. So we'll move things that's overflow and all of these things into that one and then we'll take it from there. 
You can also get the train to come in here. But anyway, we uh, I think this is a better loading kind of arrangement. It's also going to be huge. The other thing I wanted to do was build one of these big silos. I'll show you the silo now. Um, okay, let's uh, switch off the wireframe. I think that's going to be okay for now. We'll get that going. Uh, just want to make sure we have um, these all set up so that they don't uh, become too problematic for us. I think that's going to be okay. Uh, the other thing I wanted to do was just get one of these switches in place here. I think we only need, basically only need the one. We'll do that. Uh, we'll commission all of these guys. Uh, this guy won't be able to build. Because you can't get there. Can't start it from that side. So we'll need to... Oh, crap. My goodness. So shall we... Oh, something was burning. Um, if we try... If we try and do a little wooden one on the other one... Why can't I struggle so much with this over here? Because we don't have the ability to run these in both directions yet. Hmm. If I do this one... We'll be able to build that piece, but not the other one. Uh, oh, unless, unless we do this. Unless we do this. So we'll build that one first, then we'll build the other one. Uh, but there won't be... <laughs> won't be able to... Yeah, this is going to be so problematic, really. Won't be able to turn around. Where's, where's my... Some, something's wrong with my trains. They should, they're should stuck somewhere. Yeah, here they are. Uh, for some reason, I keep having this issue, and I don't quite know why. <laughs> you guys probably know and are screaming at me. Um, so I'll do that. We'll stop that. We'll start it again. So now everything should be working. I'll have a look at that now. Man, trains. <laughs> if you're trying to build the trains yourself, it does, uh, it does cost you a fair bit to get, get that to work. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a little double switch like this. So we'll do that double switch there. Uh, what we'll need to do is I'm going to pause the game and we will... I'm going to remove a lot of these guys. Um, hmm. Basically, I want these guys to be coming in all the way through here. My goodness, let's just take out all of this. Okay, now, I want the guys to be running straight through that entire section. So, they'll block this entire piece. Let's remove these two. And those two. And, ooh. And these two. And those two also. And over here, and here we can actually have the split. So we'll have a mixed uh, one over there, and then we'll just have a, no, it won't be a chain. It'll just be uh, something like this. So it'll run through there, We'll be able to go onto both sides. This is, we have a similar issue right over there. These guys will be working. We'll be able to get all the way over here. And then this will be back to normal. So just this section is going to be just the one piece. I believe that'll work. Uh, let's just be sure. This needs to be a chain though. So let's make sure this is in fact a chain. Then... Yeah, I would want that one to be clear before they actually block this up. So that'll be a chain, so it'll check whether this is open for it to enter. It'll check whether this is open for it to enter. If it wants to enter over here, it will check whether this is open for it to run through over over here. And then it'll join join that piece. So it's going to be a little bit of a tough going for the, for this, for the time being. Uh, this guy has kind of lost his way, but I'm sure it'll find it again. Just made a few changes over there. Oh, we built these. My goodness, really quick, really quick. 
quickly build those. Uh, what is going on with this uh, this section over here? Let's just quickly have a look at our signaling. And I know I'm, uh, these guys are taking a lot of my time. So that whole thing is a switch all by itself. Uh, and I'm kind of thinking this probably needs to be a chain to say that if you want, you need to be able to get out through there. Yeah, I think that was the issue. We need this switch area here to be clear. That's basically, basically what we're talking about. And I think the rest of it should be fine. I think the rest of it should now be fine. Okay, so these guys are now built and we can move people in here, unable to get food. Oh, this is built too, excellent. Uh, we'll start uh, distributing to that soon-ish, soon-ish. Uh, okay, all of these uh, little roads here have been built. So let's um, make sure to start the construction of the rest of this. So I'll, as a starting point, we'll just kind of really, okay, there it goes. And we'll just start tying um, those three in. So let's start the construction piece over there. I, I'm happy that we've kind of sorted, um, we're, we're kind of managing it fairly nicely over here. We'll tie these two in like so, and we'll also get those built. That's gonna be awesome. Now, now we can start moving a lot of our people because we've got a thousand people that is stuck somewhere, um, stuck at home with their parents. Uh, like, let's uh, see where you're at. Whoa, a hundred of them are right over here. So we'll come and move a lot of them out straight away. We'll grab a lot of these guys over here. We'll come and move them. Okay, that should be fairly helpful. I'm gonna grab a ton of these guys right over here. Ooh, 92 right there. Wow, we need to move a ton of these guys. Let's move a ton of these guys from straight over here. No, nope, all of them. Okay, so hopefully uh, we'll start seeing that work a little better. Let's move some people from over here. Okay, so hopefully that'll help. We'll need to move, let's move a few from this side. Okay, that's good, that's good. We're building more stuff. Um, over here, still no issues with people living with their parents, which is quite an interesting one. Okay, so that's good. We've moved a lot of people over now. This, we still need to maybe move some people. Wow, we filled these two up big time. Nice, and we're making good money from, uh, from our tourists, I believe. Good money from our tourists. They're getting all of their needs met over here. Uh, we can start moving some of these things in. These are all connected. These are all connected. So once, wow, that's been done. Looking good, looking good. Any issues here? No, all of this is moving. I think it was just that chain signal that was my, my problem right over there. All of this is going, all of that. That section's been done, actually. Okay. Uh, the highway here, I think I'm loving the, the highway. This is done. So this should be constructible. It is in fact getting some construction going. So can we maybe get a few other bits and pieces in here? Let's get a few more um, pieces to come and help. So let's do that. We'll get that. All of those will come and help on the construction, I believe. That's good. Um, all of the, the rest of this is fairly slow. Uh, oh, the rail construction is going pretty well. Uh, over here now, we probably have some issues. That guy's coming through there. Have we started construction on any of these? So what are we starting construction on? Is it this one? No, so where is that guy? Go? Oh, that guy's probably heading off into this general direction. Uh, so maybe we don't necessarily need to mess it up as much as we have been. Now that guy will get through. Uh, maybe it's not the end of the world. It'll space those lines out a little bit more. Here it goes. Um, so that's been done. That's awesome. We still need power over here. Uh, we need some um, firefighting vehicles and obviously workers over here to get that going. But I believe that's most of this um, infrastructure done. We could start working on this guy. So let's get that done first. And these roads are still under construction. So let's keep that going. Let's keep that going. And what's going on over here? Have we managed to move anything here? Oh, we probably need to actually assign some stuff. Let's get MV to work on this. I think MV can 
quite comfortably um, start working here. And MV like so. Let's get MV to, to help out over there. Feels a little weird. And then uh, we'll start working on this one also. Okay, so now we've got all of this. I want to build, oh, I wanted to show you guys the big one. And um, the modded, uh, here it is, the big grain storage. So I wanted to actually replace one of these guys with a big grain silo so we can manage to, um, to uh, store a little bit more. I think that will help us a fair bit more. Alternatively, we can also move it somewhere over here as part of this whole arrangement. And could we connect it? I'm kind of wondering whether that's a, a feasible option for us. Okay, all of this is going. Let's quickly have a look at what is going on with our heating situation. I'm hoping, I'm hoping everybody is got has got good heating. Uh, not too bad, not too bad, no issues, no issues. No issues, Ooh, dropping a little, maybe workers. Uh, not workers, I think. Anyway, maybe you've been a little bit of workers. Is this one over capacity? Yeah, we're using all of it. No, I think it's okay. I don't think it will drop too much, but maybe we're over capacity a little bit. Um, all of this is working nicely now. Nicely. Ooh, this one. Uh, the tourists are gonna have a little cooler time over here. Maybe a little bit. Ooh, we need to bring in a couple of ambulances over here. Apparently the tourists don't actually walk to the hospital. So let's quickly come over here, buy a couple of ambulances. We can just get two. So let's grab ambulances, something that's new. These guys from Czechoslovakia. Grab a couple of them and we'll move them on over. That almost done? Still working there. Okay, let's bring uh, this guy over here and that guy over there. I wouldn't mind getting our vehicles up and running. That would be so cool. What's going on with our tourism? In oh, look at that, guys. 104,000? That's really good. I do love it. I do love it when our income is uh, boosted up like that. These constructions should be going. Uh, we've got full houses over here. Um, and this is all done. Okay, let's get the con uh, let's get the stuff up and running over here because at the moment we have no goods whatsoever um, over here. So I need to set up some distribution. Uh, I think we can just get this guy to actually do it. So let's just add add this stop right over there. Go down all the way. And what are we doing? We're not loading. We are actually unloading. We're unloading food. We're unloading clothing. We're unloading electronics, and we're unloading meat. That is all that we need to unload. We'll pop that up to about 50% and that's gonna be awesome. So now they'll start bringing in the stuffs. The school over here is doing a good job. The, we have a kindergarten that still needs to be built though. These constructions will be underway. These guys are walking around over here doing their thing. Let's see about maybe connecting this guy up so that that can start happening too. These constructions are doing a good job. We'll need to tie these in. So let's see about doing some of that. So let's do this. Come on. No, it doesn't want to connect. That one does. Come on, come on, do a connection. Do a connection, buddy any which way you want. Really? It's not going to work? I'll have to uh, realign that building then a little bit to get that to work. Okay, let's uh, get those built. What I'll do is I'll clear out this building and we'll get a new one in there. I hope I can find the one that we've actually placed there. So residential buildings. I think it's just this one. Yep, that's the one. Now let's... Uh, Really? Oh, there it goes. Uh, I think that'll work. So we'll do that one right there, and this one should be able to tie in there. Perfect, there we go, nice. Now we'll get all of that building going, and hopefully we'll move most of the people into their own houses. Ooh, death rate is going up a little bit. Is it, uh, is it again? It's not a food thing. Hang on, it's got, I'm hoping it's not a food thing. We're working on, we need to do, redo the uh, distribution. Let's quickly have a look. 
food. Um, there might be a little bit of a shortage of food in this area, but that should now be sorted out fairly quickly. There's some food here, there is food here, there's a fair bit of food over there. Um, these guys have food, these guys have food. So yeah, really the only issue with food is there's not enough um, food distribution going on right over here. So if we have a look, these guys will probably be saying that there will be some people unable to get um, food. Meat? Meat is a less of an issue. Food, yeah. Whoa, 158 unable to get food. So that's the issue. There's a big food shortage in this area, which uh, as soon as these guys get some goods in, we should be able to um, help that situation a fair bit. Probably, probably worth our while to get maybe another little store somewhere. Probably worth our while to get maybe another food store. Here we go. Clothing arrived. Electronics arrives. Honestly, you bring clothing and electronics and no food or meat? Feels, feels wrong. Where's my food? Oh, here comes, here, I believe here comes meat. Tons and tons of meat coming in now. Uh, but still not going to have food though. There we go. And we should have meat available. Nice. So meat will now be available. Wow, lots of meat coming on in. This guy should find his way and drop off some food. Still no food. Oh, I need to limit these amounts. For crying out loud, limit these amounts. And bring up, bring up my food. Keep doing this. Food okay, clothing fine. Let's drop these, let's drop those. Let's drop that. Probably, yeah, that, that should be okay right about there. 25 tons is the rest of that. Food? No food. Still no food. Yeah, I should have limited it a while ago. This is okay. This only takes the one, so it'll be uh, another load or two coming in. These are constructed or being constructed. This is under construction now, finally. Um, there's still a bit of work going on over here. We are, I still haven't managed to finish this guy off. We are waiting on a little bit more asphalt. Really? Missing resources asphalt. Hmm. So this guy is picking up asphalt over here. So let's quickly have a look. Are we not uh, managing to produce any asphalt? No workers at the moment. No workers at the moment. We have a bus that runs through here, don't we? No workers. Uh, here it comes. So it's a matter of, it's not a, it's not a very reliable source of asphalt, I think. Uh, not bringing any workers this way, is it? Okay, what I'll do is I'll move some of these guys so they actually go over there until we can get a, a more um, significant source available. Because I think that's part of our problem. Um, if we're talking asphalt, please come and get our asphalt somewhere over here. So please do that. Concrete, come and get concrete over here, and um, gravel, gravel should be okay where you are. Okay, hopefully that'll help um, that situation a little bit. These buildings are popping in quite nicely. What's going on with our population? Uh, we're holding steady. We're holding steady. We should now have food available. We still don't have food? For crying out loud, what's going on with our food? We're out of food. That's the issue. We're not creating food quickly enough. Do we have everybody working? We've got a... Well, there's very few people here. Okay, part of our issue might be that we've now messed things up with our trains. <laughs> uh, oh my goodness, this hasn't moved in like ages. Okay, let's uh, let's just bring, bring stuff back that I've taken out. Well, at least a little bit. Hopefully, oh look at this, this is part of our problem right here, part of our problem is some of these things, that's, oh man, we should still be able to at least power everything, yeah, okay, that's fine, 
But yeah, now we're making money and I'm kind of, I know it's not in the spirit of this, this the, what I was trying to do, but some of these things, like the rail switches and things, just make it so difficult um, to actually build something on live rail. Rail that we're actually using. I mean, this section is not under construction. This section is probably still missing some stuff. No workers, no me mechanisms out here. Is there another clash here? No. No, this is just working. This should be working now. Okay, maybe everything will, will get moving again. Okay, we needed to move some people. Let's move some people. Hopefully our our issue with the, with the food is, is fairly well resolved by now. Still a lot of... Look at all these people that we need to move. Okay, if we, we should be able to just move from the one building there. Okay, hopefully that will uh, move a fair chunk of these guys over to this building where there's now availability. Um, over here... Anyway, as, as more of these get built, we will uh, see what we can do. Food? Yes, food is available. Food is available, which I'm hoping means um, how people will not starve anymore. And um, how far can they actually get here? Really? They can't get there? Okay, let's have a look. Let's see if we can maybe do something to improve this situation. We can't get them in there, but what we could do is we could provide them with a little bit of a, a little bit of an access facility um, through here. Okay, so something like that. Let's start off with that. We'll get that under construction. That'll help um, this. What we can then also do is we can, well, presumably, well, we wanted to connect these guys in through here which I think is part of the uh, part of the plan so once that's up and running that should work got a number of these housing facilities popping in how much food do we have are we running through the food fairly quickly uh, we still have we should have a fair bit of food available here most people should be able to get their food requirements here even though there might be a little bit of a, a wait from time to time I think if as long as we distribute properly over here shouldn't be the end of the world should not be the end of the world. We're making a decent amount of money from everything. Uh, people are dying quicker than they're being born. And we've still got a fair number of people living at home. And um, we've got a pretty educated population. It's mainly the kids, I think, that's not educated. And we continue to build schools and universities to make sure that we can continue our, our growth in that way. This looks pretty good here. Yeah. I wanted to look at maybe doing something in this area. So, modded sporting facility. Let's quickly go over here. So, sports playgrounds. Can we do a stadium? Not, not that's going to not look awkward in this spot. We could potentially do something out here somewhere. I wouldn't mind doing something like that at some point. There's too much infrastructure in this location here. And if we build it out here, it's not necessarily going to be too useful. Uh, maybe something slightly smaller. Whoa. Something slightly smaller over here, maybe. That's not too bad. Um, that one, bowling alleys. These guys are also pretty huge. So we won't necessarily be able to get any of these things in here. But like this school gym, maybe something like that could work. Yeah, well, let's get some of these gyms at least in here. Actually, this spot right here, not too bad. We'll have power, we'll, yeah, okay, I'm, I'm comfortable with it. We'll do that. Oh, I need to do some distribution over here also. Has this been, been built? No, we're still waiting on finishing that construction off. So we'll need to get uh, this piece constructed. Those two should be uh, good enough. Uh, actually, we could do all of these. 
like so. That should all be pretty good. And then we can see about getting what we'll do on that side. Um, this is all built. We haven't actually tied these two together yet. Uh, that rail is pretty close to being done. I don't know why some of these rail sections are taking a really long time to build. Um, these are all built. Let's quickly see about moving a few more people around. This is not looking too badly. Um, let's uh, empty out one of these guys uh, towards this side. How many people in here? 225? Okay, that's good. So that would, emptying that one out should move most of those into the spots where we need them. Um, we, need, we need the one with the highest quality, basically. A 91 quality, this is a 90 quality. So a 91 quality here. We'll just grab that guy and we'll move a bunch of these people out over this way. Uh, even more. There we go. That should hopefully draw in a lot of these extra people into those facilities right there. Uh, even these guys are pretty full. Let's uh, let's move a few of them over too. Wow, that's pretty much it. Okay, now the uh, the kindergarten should be able to pro provide some spaces for people. Nice. So this area, we really need to start working on the next piece of construction over here, the next round of these guys. So let's start laying those out a little bit. Are we still seeing people die? Whoa, at a massive rate. It must still be food. Let's have another quick look at food. Ooh, yeah, these people over here are not happy. Even over here, not happy, not happy. Uh, but this side, I think, is okay. Yeah, this side is okay because we're getting food where we need to. Yeah, which is just not producing the food. Let's go on. Let's have another look over this way. Ooh, completely empty. Any workers? Really struggling. Really struggling. Okay, this is under construction now. Um, I wouldn't mind grabbing MV to come and work here as well. So let's get a couple of MV um, vehicles and things. There we go. I think MV, the MV team, MV equipment can also come on in. Uh, hopefully they will build things a little quicker if we have the MV team coming this way too. MV team should be getting through here fairly okay. Whew, okay, food is a massive issue for us. Even though we seem to have food available, we don't, are we not? We have food available here though. There and here. We have food available. Let's, uh, let's go back here and just have a quick look. So food is available in fairly high in fairly high numbers. Oh, that one's out. Oh, and these two are out. <laughs> food is coming in, but that we get out really quickly. We, we almost need a facility that only has... Yeah, so food is just moving out as quickly as it's coming in. Hmm, I'm thinking. <sighs> What's these guys doing? We have availability yet? What's this guy's? What are these guys up to? They're moving crops. Okay, but what you could also do is you could also pick up food at the customs house. And I would like you to move food over here. We do a little bit of this and we bring food in directly from the customs house, unload food for us and food I would like, uh, just get food at 90%. Um, I think that would be helpful. So these guys will now quickly start running food for us. Could do with a few more vehicles. Uh, we need some, some firefighting vehicles, so let's do that. Firefighting, firefighting. Ambulance, come on. Fire trucks. Um, good fire trucks. Level 10, level 9. I think these guys, level 12s. Let's get to two level 12s. Start moving them to where we need them to go. This is now empty, so let's get a few more covered holes here too. Okay, that's fine. Move you over there. Move you over here. And then we can move some fire trucks 
to this area. Not that we have any workers out here. Oh, this is built. Nice. I like it. I like it, but we don't have any workers out here just yet. So we'll get the two fire trucks out here as a starting point. They can come and park here. All of this is now pretty done. Okay, let's get going on some construction over here. I'm happy to tie that one in, so let's get going on that. Uh, probably need to get going on this one. Get that going. Oh, look at that. The rail is making its way. Those sections are being done. This section still needs a little bit of work. Can we bring in maybe... Um, not sod aggregate. Let's get Irinsky um, aggregate to please also join the mix. Oh, I think everything is here now. Oh, it's not aggregate they still need. Oh, a little bit of aggregate. Okay, no, it's, it's working. It is slowly working, doing its thing. Not a lot of construction going on over here. We're not finishing off these. So it's it's there, but it's we're not getting getting the work done. We shouldn't have vehicles getting stuck. I think we've we've managed to resolve most of the issues. Oh, we do in fact have vehicles getting stuck. Okay, okay. So this was the issue. We couldn't just didn't find the problem. Let's um, let's try that. Let's have another look. I know you guys are frustrated by this, but. Don't care. I'm having fun. <laughs> um, okay. Ah, oh, I see. So this one... I don't need this one to be a chain. What I need to be a chain is... This. I need that to be a chain. Because I want that one to be clear all the way through through here, basically. We're basically keeping that entire thing all clear now. Maybe that'll solve the issue. I'm not convinced, but maybe. Uh, let's see how much food we have available over here. There is food available here now. There is food available over here. There is food available over there. There is, oh, tons of food available over here. Nice, I like it. I like it. Maybe we've uh, we've dealt with our big food issue now. If we could just uh, hold it all off now, we're back down to 25 and a half thousand, but I think we may have managed to, um, to uh, resolve some of the biggest issues here. Still have a fair bit of room available now. Oh, and I want to check how far can these guys actually get connected through here. Yeah, so what I'm keen on is just trying to get a connection straight through here. Uh, hopefully that will... We do that. Um, maybe that will help us out a little bit, get these guys a little closer. this. Can we squeeze through here? Can we, we can, we can squeeze around there. I'm not sure that's really helpful, but we may as well do it. Should be okay. We'll build all of these sections. Try and get more people able to walk here. Um, yeah, maybe with that built, I don't know. I don't know though. Uh, this connection through here. Uh, let's add another little connection. I always kind of thought we needed maybe another connection through there. No, don't pay for it. Just get that going in. Hopefully that helps us out. Now, I was thinking maybe we could start getting some big guys on this side. No, maybe let's just, just to slow it down for a tad. This is looking really good. I do like this little tight tight area over here. We could do with some stuff on the corner here, but really that looks really good. We could do with some trees and stuff, but I do like that. That's awesome. That is awesome. We're doing a, a decent job, I think. I think, if I have to say so myself, we're doing a decent job. Uh, okay, everything seems to be moving again. 
This guy will probably go through as soon as... Yeah, that's fine. As long as it all just keeps moving, I'm happy. I'm happy. Construction is underway over here. A lot of stuff being delivered. Uh, this obviously needs to be built. The rail, the rail piece. But we can start moving things in here. Oh, this, is this empty? Have a look. No, it's not empty yet. Yeah, so none of that's empty yet. Um, ooh, the other thing, the other thing that I wanted to do is I needed to actually stop, stop going to CP Dandelion. So let's just um, stop that one. Now you can actually clear it from here. So stop importing it for now. For now, I'm actually quite tempted that we can import to this area. We can import crops here if we wanted to. Look at this. Look at all of this stuff. Oh my goodness. And they're all coming through there. They're not coming through here. Oh man. We could, we could look at getting the next piece of road in here. Let's just find our road spot through there. Doesn't want to... This is so crappy. There's some mods for this, and I might start using those comb mods for the for the distribution. This is getting so messy, really. Oh, and we can't go underneath there. This is getting really, really messy. Yeah, honestly, we just can't get through here. Look at that. We just can't get through. Yeah, it's really messy. We need to. I need to fix all of our power distribution pieces really need to do that it's just too messy at the moment yeah our railway lines are not efficient not in the least but how is this going are we doing a better job now that's going down the death rate is going down births is looking a little better that number is still not um, not pleasant do we still, can we kind of find out where these guys are? Still over here, still over here though. That's just crazy. Well, let's grab these guys, we'll uh, move a lot of them. Okay, so hopefully that does uh, help us out a little bit. We'll grab one of these, we'll empty one of these out. Okay, did we manage to do that? Okay, now let's just see how far are we reaching. Oh, now we're uh, reaching a little further. Only a little further. So yeah, it's not the best spot there, but at least, I mean, if I go to this guy, that guy should be able to reach the other shop, right? Yeah, the other shop is fairly close. So we are doing a decent job. This guy, where would you go and need your food? You can go that side. Okay, let's see this big guy over here. Where do you get your food? You'll have to go that side. So this one has a lot of burden on it. A lot of burden. Shop is at the front. Quite a lot. Okay, let's see how's the food quality here. Is it coming up? Oh, this is looking awesome. That still needs a little bit more doing. Um, I'm thinking another little shop right over here maybe will do the trick. Let's try and find a small shop. Um, hang on, let's have a look. Shops. A small shop, a shopping center. Um, would be good, but it's only a single connection? Why would you have a single connection to the shop? Anyway, I'm not going to use that then, obviously. Uh, now, let's get the normal kind of vanilla, vanilla shops. Uh, it's just the grocery store, really, that I'm after. Can we not get it in here? Come on, we should be able to squeeze it in. This is really close. Come on guys, so close. Oh, come on. There we go. That's the one. We'll get that shot going on over there. <sighs> now, Oh, we don't need, oh, we need meat in here, but they'll meet, meet, they'll just have to go, 
straight straight to. So how much does this actually store? 7.5 tons of food. Do we do directly to the shop here? It's pretty big. So let's oh no, no, let's get the little modded modded thing in there. Um, we don't have a joint storage though, so we'll get the small the modded one. The small modded one, this one. Unless we do like forklifts or something, we won't uh, we won't actually get this to work. Yeah, that's fine. We're gonna start construction on that. So we'll have uh, at least some food availability um, in this area. So these guys can walk up there, get their food, um, just to help this a little bit because this area I think is where we're struggling a little bit the most. There's not. Uh, we run out of food too quickly over here for these guys to be helpful. So an extra little food store right there is hopefully going to help us. Yeah, it's, it's this one. This one is struggling to, uh, to cope under the pressure and um, once, uh, once we obviously run out it takes a while for the distribution to get there. That's why we are redoing our distribution. Um, starting with this piece over here. How's this going? Are we emptying this one out? Not quite yet, these guys. Not quite yet. Almost tempted to do the big one over here somewhere. Just start a new, start fresh with a new big chunk of them. But we can also unload um, from a train. So we can bring in grain from a train, a grain train. A grain train. Oh, that's all been done. All those deliveries. We are making progress with this one. Are we making progress over here? These are done. What's who's working on this? Uh, a lot actually. Uh, we'll probably get Irinsky Industrial Construction involved also to start working on some of these. Hopefully, stuff will start arriving for construction there. This is all done. I like that. Oh, I put some trees in the middle. Look at that. That's our highway right there, guys. Our, the start of our highway. It'll take us a while to have a really good highway, but I think it's a good starting point. Really a good starting point. We need to uh, plow it more once it's in use, though. Once it's in use. What's going on over here? Uh, getting better. Getting better. The death rate is dropping. Death rate is dropping, but we still Oh, down to 25. Let's just check our our heating again. Interiors are okay. Interiors are okay here. Interiors are okay there. Interiors are okay here. And our interiors are okay over there. So heating is now not a problem. It's food that's a problem. Let's go and have another look at our food. Man, it is so difficult. I do want us to get some nuclear power going on also. Food over here is not a problem. There's food available in those facilities and in these facilities. And we just need to move food a little quicker into some of these areas over here. I think that'll be okay, really. This is good, this is good, this is good. Uh, what's going on here in terms of our numbers? Can we up this a little bit more? Yeah, I think that's better. And then what we'll do is let's find out where, which distribution facility is uh, is working on um, Irinsky Road Cargo Station 3. Uh, we are upping it to, to 90%. Is this one, right? And where does it get? Where can it collect? It can collect food from Sokos Food. Ah, this is the issue. It can't collect, it doesn't collect food anywhere else. Okay, well, what we'll do is we might add, and see, this is the piece. This is, it's such a mismatch of, oh, no, no, it is, it's got this guy, but it's not picking up food there, is it? This is Irinsky Road Cargo Station. We're just not picking up food here. No. What was that? That's the Boroslav Road Cargo Station. But this one is, which one is this one? I don't see Road Cargo Station, it's picking up meat here? How? There's no meat available out there. I don't see Road Cargo Station. Let's just make sure to pick up food here too. Um, that's good. We, uh, I think that's probably my, my bad, I moved it. Anyway, that's why the whole thing needs a bit of a revamp. 
the whole thing needs a bit of a revamp. But in order to do that, um, I'm just trying to keep us uh, surviving. I want this facility um, up and running be before we really start looking at that. It's getting pretty messy, guys. It's, I wouldn't, I'm not going to lie to you. It's getting pretty messy. This construction is underway. Not bad. They, this is taking this is taking a fair bit of time. Uh, that's done. I do like the fact that that's done. These guys are going around. Probably need some technical services around at some point. Yeah, but we don't have power here. We don't have uh, good temperatures over here. Do you need temperatures? Temperature in this building is too low. I don't know if we need if, if we have a temperature issue with any of these other facilities. Liking our highway, really liking our highway. We need to build that too. Mm. Anyway, there's a lot that's um, under construction at the moment. Food available over here. Food available over here. Yes, we do in fact have food available over here. Maybe, maybe we're um, helping the food issue a little bit now. If we go to people and see what's going on with the food situation. This is coming up a little better now. That is maybe slowly moving up. We still have some some issues. This is food. Um, this is food available. That's good. This is food available. Hopefully, hopefully that means we've we've uh, resolved, stemmed off the worst of it now. Let's see. Are we? Oh, yeah. We are pretty much starting to look into growing again, and we're just about at the end of winter too. Uh, let's quickly have one more look at what's going on here. We've not run out of um, out of crops. Are we making a fair bit of food now? We are. Yeah, so we uh, had a bit of a, a, a slump in terms of actually producing food. And all of these things just take so long to get done. Uh, we're missing asphalt. Where's the asphalt coming from? Yeah, Zod doesn't actually do asphalt. I believe not well. So we don't have any workers here. Is there any workers on this bus? Yeah, so by the time they get here, there's no more workers actually arriving here. Mm. It's not good because a lot of our workers is getting off over here. Um, and that might be part of our problem. Yeah, so workers getting getting to getting to all of these spots is a little bit of a challenge. Okay, and that's the end of winter, and I think that's what I'm going to call it. The end of winter, calling it the end of winter. This is the new facility being built. And probably need to work on some of these roads. Improve them a little bit. Oh, look at that. This is lots of construction traffic over here. Luckily, we've got a fair bit of room for vehicles to be storing. But that is looking good. We've got the rail construction going on. This area really does, um, does we, are, we can grow these areas pretty quickly now. Our construction is really looking good. How's our tourist industry yet? If we go to last month, whoa! Tourist industry last month did not do well this year. Last year, lots for tourists. So. But yeah, maybe in winter, people aren't enjoying um, the uh, what our country has to offer as much. Got no treated patients. We do have two ambulances, which I'm assuming is not going to go and get people. Um, or it's not. We don't have any tourists um, sick or dying at the moment. Let's have a look. Um, electronics seems to be the issue. Sporting facilities also. Um, these two should get built. It's looking good. We uh, we can probably expand further now. I'm, I'm very worried about maybe putting in more residential pieces in here. Do we have people living at home? We do have people living at home. Let's do one quick swoop of moving a few people around and then we'll probably need to start building um, more places. Really, we're struggling to to make sure that these people aren't... The side's looking... I think too weird's happening over there. But these, my goodness, they are... There's a lot of people here. Now, these are all okay. Well, let's try and empty out a bit more of this thing. Let's move some more of these people over. Okay, hopefully that helps us a little bit. 
Then we'll also do this one. Okay, hopefully that'll move a few more people through. Yeah, maybe. Maybe that'll be good enough for now. These are all full. Uh, we probably, you know what we do need over here is another spot to pick up workers. Let's place one in there just before we get out of hand. Uh, if we forget about it, uh, let's get a do, 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 another train, train depot. No, we're looking for a platform, transport platform, platform station. That's the one. Um, something reasonable. I'm not sure if any of these guys really work well. Yeah, I'm also not sure that that's... Look at these. Oh. This spot over here is not too bad. If we can... should be able to do that. That'll actually work really nicely. Yeah, let's do that. Let's start a construction over there. And we'll tie that one through there. I think that's, that's not bad. That's not bad. So we'll get um, going on those. So we'll get that one built. These are under construction at the moment. Uh, we still need to tie this one in and get uh, get the, this area built. But we don't have cars at the moment. I still needed to do the, um, the moving of this stuff. Oh, that one got built. Uh, this is a sign, so that should hopefully get built too. And then we hopefully get that one built, and then we can move in some new vehicles over here. We'll get the distribution set up. Uh, a lot keeping us busy. Let's move a few more people from maybe out over here. Yeah, so hopefully that'll cover off most of those issues. Now we are starting to see growth again. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching. It's been another awesome episode. All of this is obviously taking ages to, to get done, um, but we are making progress. It is taking a long time. I might do some more time lapses to get us there a little quicker. I am really contemplating um, paying for some of these facilities. Oh, actually, where did Wow, okay, okay, that's not too bad, that's not too bad, so you actually have the ability to then loop around, oh I like it, I like it, okay, then if that's the case, it's not the end of the world really, I wouldn't mind getting this one built though, can we assign that, let's try to assign that one and then I'll end the episode. Let's just get that one assigned. So we want um, this facility over here to please um, start work on the other side here. Once that's built, I believe it should be able to get there. Can't connect to it. That was my worry. Can't find a connection to it. So it, it's willing to do this little loop on its way out, but not on its way in. So it doesn't want to build it. Um, Oh, no, you need to definitely get get from the other side. You need to be able to get there. Um, okay, well, let's try what I've what I had in mind here first. So I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna try it one more time and um, I'll stop this. So what I'll do is I'm going to That one is that gonna that's gonna let me get there, right? Yeah, it's gonna let me get there. It's gonna be able to get there now. Don't know why that guy is going straight through there. Anyway, doesn't matter. Guys, thank you so much for watching. If you've liked it, as always, please hit that like button. Please, we're just not feeling getting these guys moving out quick enough. We'll need to start um, constructing some more um, some more buildings here. Guys, again, thank you. That's the end now. And um, if you've liked it, hit that like button. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.